Well, hi, nice to meet you. I'm glad you can join us. I'm Amanda, and this is Bella, my daughter. She's 12, and she has some questions she would love to ask you. Oh, wonderful. Let, let, let's hear them. Okay, go ahead. Okay, so I know most things are animated on the show besides you. So how difficult was that to get used to? Oh, gosh. It, you know, in theory, it was really difficult because I had never done anything like that. I, I came from theater and I had been doing Aladdin on Broadway for almost five years at that point. And the, the, the things that, that I have done on television are uh, reflect the real world. So there are like actual doors, there are actual props mm -hmm. and costumes. And then when I found out that I got this show, I got really nervous because I was like, oh my gosh, it's, I'm going to have to think of how to use the green screen and, and, and well, how is that going to work out? But when I got to set, I realized it's not that scary. And it's not scary at all, actually, because there are so many people behind the camera, directors, animators, um, producers, that are making sure that I have the right eye lines, that there are little pieces of tape, and that there are tennis balls sometimes. Um, and then I realized that, you know, I, I as an actor, especially going through school, we didn't have sets or costumes until we started working professionally. So technically, we've been working with imaginary characters our entire careers. Um, and it was just a, a coming home. So thank, huge thanks to the team uh, back in Toronto. Yeah, we just got our green screen. We were kind of playing around with it. There's like, there's, there's blue. <laughs> so we were having fun with it. So yeah, well, you can see how the, well, you want to do your next question? Yeah. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> I noticed that Blue's Clues is more modern now, like how you don't get letters, you get emails. So mm -hmm. I was wondering if you're going to touch on more like modern or even popular topics like wearing masks or having safety through these hard times? Yeah, that's a great question. You know, I don't think any of us really uh, thought this would happen. I know that we, we thankfully have institutions that their job is to think about these terrible things <laughs> and plan for them. But us as, a, as, as, a, as an entertainment company and an educational company, we've never encountered anything like this. So it'll be interesting to see how, how everyone across all mediums, children's television, and uh, in, even in our favorite sitcoms and TV shows, if masks will pop up, just because that's just gonna be uh, a way of life. Um, but I know that Blue's Clues and Nickelodeon especially, we know that we have a responsibility to um, acknowledge things that are happening in our world because we want to have uh, help kids and make sure that they're prepared for that real world. And so I'm, I'm really excited to see what our team cooks up and that, you know, even though we get email, we still get packages and we still get mail. And season two, there are a lot more letters and, and, and packages that, that come up. So definitely look out for those. I'm really, really excited. Okay. So um, you mentioned how you were in theater before, mm -hmm. and I eventually want to be involved with theater. So do you have any advice for people who want to go into the acting industry? Yeah, I would say to practice your craft, you know, um, believe in yourself. But at the same time, I would definitely encourage for you to explore the other things that you love. Um, it doesn't mean that you're not going to be pursuing theater, but as, as we all know, uh, acting and theater and television is a reflection of life. And unless we're living that life, it's very difficult to empathize with somebody that um, maybe you're playing an artist and you, uh, you have never really drawn or painted before. Um, it would be really helpful to explore, oh, well maybe let's, I'll try to take a painting class and try to understand that. And then you find out that you love it. Uh, I, I've, I myself love photography. And what I've done is that, you know, I've taken that hobby and uh, I turned it into a headshot business when I was in theater. And now I'm um, taking more video and more, uh, more portraits. And because I know uh, those, uh, learn those skills. Now I was able to, to film the virtual play dates that are going to be airing on, on Nickelodeon. And uh, had I not pursued that hobby and that love, um, we wouldn't be able to put out some, some of the content that we're putting out. So you never know how it's all going to come together as an actor. Um, but stay curious and keep learning because you never know what you're going to use. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Great question, Bella. <laughs> 
So um, I was wondering, have people like noticed you out of your work, mm -hmm. like on the streets? Yeah, it's, it's, it's very funny because it's usually uh, parents. Parents and very, very young kids. Uh, um, and it's always flattering. It's always an amazing uh, interaction because everyone's just so excited. Uh, the, the things that really get make me laugh are the uh, little kids that, that haven't uh, learned to speak yet. And so I'll be standing um, after the Thanksgiving Day Parade, after we performed, I went back home and we rode the train. And so it was a packed train and there was a baby, maybe like, one or maybe two tops, mm -hmm. but um, I want to say uh, one year old, and he was looking at me as I was standing because there were no seats, and he was just looking at me very thoughtfully, and <laughs> and then I was like, he might know who I am, and then I I thought I heard him say Blokle, uh -huh. and I was like, I think I know, I think he knows who I am, and as we were <laughs> leaving the train, the mom, uh, really really wonderfully, she looked up and she said. We love your show. You did a great job today. And so he did. So those are the, the things that really make me smile, that even someone so young uh, knows is responding so well to our show. Oh, that's yeah. sweet. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how much that. All right, you have some more. Let's yeah. See. yeah. Well, um, I know um, when I was younger, I watched Blue Clues when they had the other guy. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so were you because like, you're so old now? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you right. know, when she back when she was young, <laughs> um, were you nervous to like follow in his footsteps because he was like such a like a legend mm -hmm. to young kids that are oh. not my age? Absolutely, I was absolutely nervous. Um, because he's who I watched with my little sister when when the show first came out, and to think that. I now have that responsibility. I was definitely nervous. I was definitely anxious, but I also knew that I, I, I couldn't be anybody else except for me. And so that's how I went into the audition. And now that I booked the job, we were about to, we were going to do uh, workshops to get ready for set. And I started to get nervous again. You know, you, you, you get over one hurdle, another one uh, is, is right in the way. And Steve, uh, is a consulting producer on the show. He writes and he directs for the show. And he pulled me aside. He's like, hey, Josh, you know, I just want to let you know, we, uh, in case no one has told you, we love you because of you and everything that you're bringing. So don't ever feel that you have to replicate uh, anything that I or Dono, uh, Donovan Patton, who plays Joe, anything that we have done in the past, we want to you to celebrate you. And it was that reminder that really put me at ease. And I hope that everybody that, uh, you know, no matter what you're pursuing, you're never going to be able to be that person that you aspire to be. But you're always able to be that best person that you are. So, um, you know, yeah, trust yourself, uh, work hard, be kind, and, and you'll end on, on, on the right side of things. Oh, well, thank you so much for taking this time to talk with us. I think we're out of time, but oh, well, thank I you know so I, we, we could you. talk all day, but thank you so much. Thank it's you. been a pleasure. And you had fun? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you guys stay safe and, and take care, okay? Thank you, Amanda. You too. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.